Hello, I'm Sri from CBTU. Welcome to the Ethical Hacker Training Course based on CEH Certification Program by EC Council. Module Penetration Testing, Section Penetration Testing Introduction. A penetration test or simply pen test is mostly authorized attack on a system to evaluate the security of the system. The test is performed to identify both weakness, vulnerabilities, including the potential for unauthorized parties to gain access to the system's features and data, as well as strengths enabling the full risk assessment to be completed. The process identifies the target systems and a particular goal, then reviews available information and undertakes various means to attain the goal. Some of the penetration test features are it helps determining whether a system is vulnerable to attack, Strength of the defenses to defeat the test. When an ethical hacker does a penetration testing, PT report will be submitted to the system owner or organization. PT report generally contains uncovered security issues, vulnerabilities, vulnerability exploitation possibilities, assessment of potential impacts to the organization, followed by the suggested countermeasures mitigation strategies to reduce the risk. Penetration tests are a component of a full security audit. For example, the PCI DSS requires penetration testing on a regular schedule or after any system changes. Flaw hypothesis methodology is a system analysis and penetration prediction technique, where a list of hypothesized flaws in a software system are compiled through the analysis of specifications and documentation for the system. The list of hypothesized flaws are then prioritized the prioritized list is used to direct the actual attacking or testing of the system. A wide variety of security assessment tools are available to assist with penetration testing including free software and commercial softwares. A number of Linux distributions include known OS and application vulnerabilities and can be deployed as targets. Such systems help new security professionals try the latest security tools in the lab environment. Examples include down vulnerable Linux, DVL, and the OWASP web testing environment, WTW, and Metasploitable. Several operating system distributions are geared towards penetration testing. Such distributions typically contain a pre-packaged and pre-configured set of tools. These are popular Linux distributions for pen testing. Kali Linux, Security Onion, Matrix, and all these. These are the popular software frameworks Burp Suite, Metasploit, Nmap, OWASP, Job, W3AF, and many others. The process of penetration testing may be simplified as two parts Discover vulnerabilities, that is, combinations of legal operations that let the tester execute and exploit the vulnerabilities. Specify the illegal operation. Once attacker has exploited one vulnerability, they may gain access to other machines so the process repeats. That is to look for new vulnerabilities and attempt to exploit them. This process is referred to as pivoting. Metasploit provides Ruby library for common tasks and maintain a database of well-known exploits. Under budget and time constraints, fuzzing, a random input technique, can be used to discover vulnerabilities. The tester uses a random input to access Less often used code paths. Well trodden code paths are usually free of errors. Errors are useful because they expose more information such as HTTP server crashes, buffer flows, etc. Legal operations that let the tester execute an illegal operation include unescaped SQL commands, unchanged results in source visible projects, human relationships, etc. Testers package the payload for the target system which triggers its execution. The illegal operation or the payload in Metasploit terminology can include functions for logging keystrokes, taking screenshots, installing adware, stealing credentials, or altering data, etc. Some companies maintain large databases of known exploits and provide products that automatically test target systems for vulnerabilities. Some of them are Metasploit, Nessus, Nmap, OpenVAS, and W3AF. Tiger teams are launched in 1970s. The federal government and its contractors began organizing teams of penetrators who are known as Tiger teams. 
Tiger teams were sponsored teams of crackers who attempted to break down the defenses of computer systems to explore security holes and remediate them. The leading computer penetration expert James Anderson described a general attack sequence steps. Find an exploitable vulnerability, design an attack around it, test the attack, seize a line in use, enter the attack, exploit the entry for information recovery. A penetration test target may be black box, white box or gray box. In black box penetration testing, hackers do not have inside access and require to gather information by footprinting, scanning, enumeration, find vulnerabilities and exploit them. In these unauthorized accesses obtained for malicious activity. White box penetration testing. A hacker is ethical hacker. He is authorized person by the organization. Hacker is aware of network architecture, security system, IP host details, etc. This is simulation attack to test the strength of the defense from outside attacks. Gray box pen testing. Hacker is aware of partial information and try to hack into the system to gain unauthorized access. This is done with non-malicious intention but for information sharing purpose. We will tour some penetration testing tools demo and take up some case studies and review ethical hacking for safe digital world. Thanks for watching.